morning. Good morning. We're off to Hollywood Studios, a Disney day. Yeah. Woohoo! Um, it's five to seven, so phones are primed on the internet, ready to book our first selection on Genie Plus. I've already yeah. bought Genie Plus. So um, you can do that before seven if you didn't know you could do that. Um, so, I didn't. so now we can just wait a few more minutes and then see what we can get. Um, we're going as soon as we've got our first ride booked. We're going to get on the bus and go straight to this bus. Yes, straight to the park. Um, they'll let you in before eight, even though that's when you can get in early entry. That's what we experienced last yes. time. So hopefully it's the same this time round. And then we can queue four rides inside the park rather than the crowd outside the park which will be there a bit later on yeah um but the, i think you said we're going to try and get on um, millennium falcon yeah. first i think yeah. um because mitchell's parents haven't done that mm. um and it's a good ride for us all to do together yeah and then we'll just see how the day takes us i mean last time we had genie plus at hollywood studios it was great because um mm. i mean we just had a nice slow day we're able to kind of stack our rides up every couple of hours and towards mm. the end of the day we were doing one good ride straight after the other so yeah, i mean i would good. hope we can get on everything really we've also got um dinner at the hollywood brand derby as yeah. well so yeah. um i really like it there we've got dining credits to use um, yes and when we just eat quick service all the time when it's just the two of us um Isn't... it takes a long time to spend all the yeah, money yeah it so. does My glasses are a bit steamy, but, <laughs> you know, we'll soldier on. We did it. We're at Hollywood. We're here. We're just about to... Uh, Go and... I was about to say check in. Buzz in, check buzz, in. Buzz. We'll see how long and where we go, how far we get in. But we managed to get our Genie Plus, as I said. Um, and then since we last spoke, I've been able to get our first ride selection for smugglers run between 8 35 and 9 35 so it was very easy very yeah. early i mean it's so early that we have to hope that we can get rides done in time but you yeah. know these are nice problems to have i suppose so uh we'll go and see where they hold us but Ooh, I guess it's good to be here tomorrow. good to be here again isn't it it is <sighs> but now we've just got a pop through security yeah um and then Wait. See, yeah, see where Just we wait. get held if we get held. It's fine, we can wait, we're at Disney. See oh. you in the park. <laughs> We're in, and now um, everybody's running to their respective rides. No running. No Fast, running. fast walking to their respective rides. Yes. Yep. Organised fun. Yes, organised fun. <laughs> so it's 7.34, um, so early park admission doesn't technically start until 8. Um, so we are just going to go where we know we need to go, which is to ride. So we're going to go left at, what's this show called? Keystone, Keystone Clothiers. 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 Oh, oh, Clothiers. Clothers. Cl clothers. Four leaf clothers. <laughs> It's so good being a Disney guest and being able to make use of these early park entry. Yes, I mean, it's just nice and quiet. Or oh, Epic Eats, that was where they've got that nice funnel cake that you like the look oh, of. Oh yeah, the funnel cake looks good. The 50th anniversary one. Yeah. I'm sure the next time we're down here later on, um, I'll show you what it looks like and it will be busy. But now it's nice. Little squirrel, they're coming on rise. Oh, no. oh, no. Too many people. <laughs> Ah, pew pew, pew pew. We do like Star Tours, we'll definitely do that today. Yeah. I'll see you later. I'll see you later. That's what we said. Will they ever do a retro looking Star Tours t shirt? I wonder. Maybe you should write to them. Here we are, transitioning into Batu. So we'll see how long the queue is. Yeah. Like we actually get in or whether we come back out. Yeah, we queued outside and, last yeah. time, didn't we? So hopefully not. Hopefully like we just queuing in. Yes, we will see and we will show you. Over there we go. Ooh, we're in where are we? Batu. Batu. <laughs> At least you know. No need to run. It's fine. Officially got in the queue at 7.40 a.m. So we'll see how long it takes. The last time we were here and did this, it broke down twice. Do you remember that? 
Oh, don't, don't you be telling everybody things like that. You keep that to yourself. Just I was about to say, oh, Chewy's over there. Yeah. Um, it's not. It's a, it's a stone. It's, it's a big a, brown stone. It's a, very similar. Prep the ready room for recruits. Commander 9 now, please report back to IGS Cockpit. resistance person. I win. <laughs> I won. We got through. I'm the winner. Oh, is that how it works? Yeah. We got captured and then we escaped. And then, so you get put on like colours and then the people that were on red, they tried to get in our front seat blue spot. Yeah. And we were like, uh, no, excuse me. That's our spot. That's our spot. You so we got front row, which is very good. Yeah. 
Very being good. a four is um, really helpful. Brilliant. So we're probably going to go and grab maybe a bit of breakfast and then it'll be time for yeah. Smuggler's Run. Oh, I forgot to how long it took. We got on there, uh, what time did we get on the ride? 7.40, wasn't it? Yeah. We got off, it was probably about quarter past eight, so yeah, 35-ish minutes, fantastic. Oh, it's very steamy. The camera's a bit steamy, but um, you still get an idea. I'm going to go and use the toilets because I've never been to these ones before. I don't even really need to go. We've got a Triple Suns plant-based uh, breakfast wrap. And it's like got fake egg, chickpeas, some slaw stuff. It's very nice. Breakfast is nice. I thought you said Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Happy Halloween. Happy <laughs> Easter. Happy New Year. So we've done a uh, smuggler's run. Yep. No, no. No. Rise. Rise. Had breakfast. Yeah, we were off rise um, at 18 minutes past eight, mm. which is amazing. Very good. And then we've got three minutes, and then it is time to go on Smuggler's Run. We had a um, free sons breakfast yeah. wrap. Mm. So we That's shared nice. that. This nice morning. and spicy. Chickpeas, yeah. fake egg, carrot, uh, flat bread. It yeah, was, it's nice. yeah, it's really nice. I suppose we have to be kind, and if we get pilots, then we give it to your parents because they've not done this. We'll see. <laughs> and uh, I've set an alarm for 9.34 because at 9.35 we can make another um, lightning egg selection. Yeah, I think we're going to try for midway. Something in store, yeah. Toy Story. Yeah. yeah. I am Hondo Omaka and this is Omaka Transport Solutions. Today I am offering the opportunity of a lifetime. Yeah. I need flight yeah. crews to transport this valuable merchandise okay. across the galaxy. Pilots to navigate. Engineers to operate the ship and gunners to defend the shipments and that is where you come in. Steamy glasses. Steamy glasses. How was Smuggler's Run? It was good. Did you do lots of shooting? I did do lots of shooting. I pretended like I was on um, Midway Mania. We gave mum and dad pilot but mum didn't want to be pilot. So you got to be pilot. So I was pilot. Yeah. I was exceptional. I don't know how you were. <laughs> I, I, I th I'd like to think I was really good at it. Oh, yeah. I win. There you, you press go. A lot of buttons. I won. You won. I'm the winner. So our next lightning lane isn't until 9:30. It's 8:59, and apparently Star Tours is a 10-minute standby. Yep, it says 10 minutes. So we'll go in, and we'll see. Very Star Warsy morning so far, which is a win. Our Star Tours. It's always super fun. Yes. Yes. You always. weren't the rebel spy though. No, I always w wish I am, but they never pick me. They always pick a bloody child. It was <laughs> we haven't now had the, um, we've got a pod racer scene and a Boba Fett scene. Yeah, I don't think we've had them before, have we? No, I don't think so. We might have had the pod race scene, I'm not sure. But um, it was very good. So we're now going to walk past Mickey and Minnie's because it is down. So we yeah. want to see when it will be up. And it's quarter past nine, having had a little look in the shop. Yep. So we are on our way to and Toy Story Land. we've done three rides. Yeah. We've got it's Midway good. Mania at 9.30, I think we've already said that, but if we haven't, that's what we've got. Yeah. Um, and then we'll see what we can get after that. I think ideally we said we'd like to get a um, Slinky Dog. Or, yeah, or, or a, a Mickey yeah. Minis, see if it's um, if that's open. open. Um, but so far, Genie Plus is winning. Yeah. Mickey Minis has just opened up, so it's like a 30 minute standby. So hopefully, when we check in to um, Toy Story Midway Mania, we'll be able to book that as a Lightning Lane selection. Thought we'd come this way into Toy Story Land. Oh, it's uh, it's 9:20 and family's already arguing. Oh, I didn't hear them. Oh yes. I was too busy looking at the girl it's with nine, the great legs. It's 9:30. Then we got a snack. Blah, blah, blah. Yes, there is a girl with fantastic, uh, thick. Would you say thick yeah, legs? Yeah, she's got good thick gym legs. I want to go run over to her and ask her how she gets them. Just congratulate her. Uh, yes, congratulations. Well done. Massive legs. Well done. They are beautiful. That was good. I win. <laughs> I won. You I say, am the winner. You say that every time. Party. What was your score? Tell the people what your score was. I don't remember. Right. So well, big. But you apparently won and you got 174,000. Very, very I, good. I apparently didn't win and I got 202,000. So the game is to get less points. One comes before two, therefore I win. <laughs> Oh goodness me, this is painful. Um, so we're going to the front of the park to maybe grab Starbucks, <laughs> have a look in some shops, and then we've got... Um, oh, we booked Mickey Minis. Yes, that's for, for 12 o'clock. For 12, although the app now says 12.05. But we can be in from 12. Um, so we're going to go do that. So I should be treated to something because I win. 
Yeah, you can buy me a Starbucks. Loser, loser pays, so get your purse out. <laughs> Bye. Look at these. It's got the baby odor. Yeah. Baby odor. It's really good. Yeah. I think they're the gonna... Star Wars ones, like the Been Here series. So you've got like one of the newer films, <laughs> and then like. My favorite, another one, my Jojo Binks. <laughs> fly bag um, he's 75 and then I really like this t-shirt and then on the back we've got that I would also very much like this mug it's good morning and then on the back it's got things to do meditate sip soup play force practice chase frogs eat cookies it's a busy day Inside out lounge fly. Oh, look at that! I know. It's blue. Is it blue? Yeah. Oh, look, here I am. Look at this one. Although I'd feel like an imposter buying it because I still haven't had a Mickey Premium bar ice cream. No, I didn't. Although, like, it smells like chocolate in here. Are they supposed to smell? But yes, I can, I can, there's like a smell of chocolate. For all your satchel school bag Mickey needs, there's a little one. An extra school bag. <laughs> $70. It's quite soft. Not, not really my kind of lounge blind though. I've been shopping. We have, or you have. I have. What have you been buying? I went into Pandora mm -hmm. and I invited I don't know if you can see it, but I bought a new O-ring for my necklace with a Mickey head on it. And then I bought a beautiful Winnie. <laughs> um, because we had the gift card from ATD, just for booking the holiday, um, it was free. Yep. Um, I've so enjoyed spending it as well. <sighs> thanks ATD um, yes. for my free Pandora yeah. accessories. Very nice. Um, I'm very happy now. Yeah, that's when nice. When he's with me all the time. Yeah. I did also have a look at, there's a real nice infinity um, stone. stone ring. Um, but I said I'd think about it. That one was $100. It was it? $100. That's um, okay. And so Winnie was $90. Yep. And the O-ring thing was 75 I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, but I didn't know that this... Um, like dangle a bit came with a mickey head on it and it says believe in magic and then on the other side it's got a little heart what are you looking at it's the dark saber Mandalorian's helmet and Baby Yoda's little shirt, chainmail shirt. We are off to no, well we've just been on Mickey and Minnie's <laughs> Runaway start. Railway. Um, it's it's super fun. Yeah. It's it's a real like it took me by surprise the last time it we came. It is surprising. It is um, surprising. And it's just like it's so different. Yeah. Like to your usual like well just yeah, it's very different. You just think it's going to be quite a quaint little. Yeah, you're in like it is. It feels like a cartoon strip. Yeah. Um, very clever. And it's yeah, it's real fun. It's um, similar. 
It's similar to the ride on Rise, like with the way that it's kind of a trackless yeah. buggy that goes around. But, but yeah, it's very, very good. And now we're off to get a bit of a bit of a snack because dinner's in. We had to book an early dinner because we've got uh, Hollywood uh, Brown, Brown Derby. Derby. So we could only get 4.40, which is obviously a tad early for dinner. But yeah. it's only about half 12 now, so we need something to tide us over. So we might share a... Sharing on yeah, the tray. Maybe um, we could get this and then go and get some blue and green milk. Could do. I've been left alone guiding the table. So Ellie's gone to order some food with mum and dad and I think she's getting it well, she's gonna get us the teriyaki um, tofu bowl and we're gonna share it. Um, and then she said that she wants to go and get some blue and green milk, which by the way is plant-based. I think we have an hour until we can book another lightning lane. And then in an hour and 15 is our next selection that we've already made and that is for Rock and Roller Coaster. The teriyaki Tofu Bowl from Backlog Express. Looks nice. How was the teriyaki bowl? It was really nice actually. Um, maybe could have done with just a little smidge more tofu. Yeah. There was maybe like four or five bits. We did share it though. I think we did. was an even amount. Okay, um, but yeah, really good. Um, nice that there's a different option, not just your regular burger, hot dog type of um, dinner. A few vegetables in there, edamame beans. Yeah. Carrot. Um, carrot, cucumber. Yeah, it was really good. What you got, mate? Uh, green and blue milk. Twister. Yeah. Green twister. It tastes like, um, you know when you go on Soarin' and you go over like the, the Polynesian beach, it tastes like the Polynesian in a cup. Yeah, agree Twister. Twister in a cup. Slightly more refreshing I think. Yeah. Oh, and if you're wondering, he won't share a straw with me. That's why I had to drink out the cup. Really you does. You gross girl germs. <laughs> Which one do you prefer? I don't know. They're so different, aren't they? What did you prefer? Um, I actually think I prefer the blue one. The blue one, I think, is smoother. That one's a bit, a bit more icy and bitty. 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 <laughs> Mitchell just said. Do you want to take a seat? Okay. Sat down. Now you've got third degree burns on my bottom. Silly man. Um, so yeah, we're on our way to um, Rock and Roller Coaster. Yep. That's our 145 Genie Plus. Uh, and on the way here or there, we swung into the Brown Derby just to make sure they check or they take our dining card that we got from Disney. Yes. Because um, we've had a couple of weird random, like Ohana Breakfast didn't take it. Yeah. Um, Main Street Bakery didn't take it because they said the cookie was merchandise. I want a snack. Which it's not, but that's fine. Yeah. Um, and they also said that the, because um, you found a list and it said the food trucks at Disney Springs take it. Yeah. One did, two didn't. Yes. Um, and the one that did their scanner was broken. So it's quite, I mean, it's probably not a complex thing to use, but it just starts to feel that way when you're getting refused the ability to use it. Hey, it's been a while. A bit squinty. Mm, yeah, it's kind of a weird overcast, but still sunny, so. Yeah, well, we've just come out of Star Tours again. Yeah. And we were just having this conversation, like how many people have been on Star Tours and had exactly the same, like first and second scene? Yeah. It's like, we've, we've never had that. And then today we were like, oh, we're going it again. It's only a 10 minute wait. Ex exactly the Explaining same scene. Oh, you get a different one most times yeah. you go on. And, and I think, I think each, of the each of the scenes are independent of each other as well so to get the same two one after each other is very unusual yes we are different like into like interlinking characters Although i do think that the um because we were on row three before yeah and now we we're on row five and i felt like it was a lot more yeah, like the back seems to be uh, back seats are great intense. um and before that we did the uh, frozen yeah. sing-along yes we did I've never done that before, nor did I ever think I would. Let it go. Yeah, half an hour of that, the whole crowd. Was but it half an hour? I think so, yeah. Wow. Yeah. It was just like, it was just starting as we were walking in, so walking yeah, by. Yeah, so we didn't have to queue for it or anything. We would literally yeah. just went in and it had like already started. Um, but it was fun. Everyone seemed to enjoy it. Yes. 
it was very good. We made it to the Brown Derby. It was very, very wet. I've got puddles in my shoes. <laughs> it's very wet. I might get some trench foot. Yes, <laughs> lovely. So we've just got the menu, just been sat down. We've, we've got a very nice table. We've deponchoed, dried them as best as we can. Yeah. Um, and looking forward to some food. Yeah, I'm absolutely starving there now. Is a, there's a plant-based risotto. And then there is, is a plant-based. Plant and there's a plant. Yeah, there's a plant-based chocolate cake. Yeah. Oh. And you looked at the baked Alaskan. Maybe. Yeah, I think I'm going to have that, and I think I'm also going to have. They used to do. Oh, a flight. A flight. A ma um, yes, a martini a flight. Oh, a martini flight. Yeah. Yeah. So I think I'm going to have that just like I did last time. Okay. Yeah. Going to get drunk, mate. A joke. I got a flight of um, martinis. Tastes like petrol in my mouth, but yes, it was very nice to have. I think there's a gin in there somewhere, which is why I chose it, because the margarita one has um, like two orange flavoured, so not for me. I'm just going to eat some bread. Salad. These are eggplant fritters. And then underneath there, oh, there I do like these. Little uh, peppers, and then there's tomato risotto underneath there. You're going to struggle with the salad on top. Good evening. Um, we finished our risotto. I thought it was delicious, and I ate every single last tiny morsel. Um, you, on the other hand, didn't explain. It was just a. It was. It was nice. I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but it, it was nice for a while. And then there was a taste or a flavour in there that became like an aftertaste. It quickly went from being, this is quite nice, to being, get that away from me, I don't want it anymore. <laughs> Hi! I've got to bake to Alaska. It looks like a little spiky hedgehog. I knew you were going to do that. He's messing around with the tripod. Stop it. <laughs> I was put in. Delicious. My uh, little hedgehog was lovely. So pudding was nice, that was my best bit. Oh no, I think my um, risotto. Oh really? Yeah. I preferred my bread. <laughs> Honestly, trying to go out with this one is like trying to feed a child. It's a bit wet. It's a bit wet. Don't touch me, mate. It's, it's a wet. bit wet. We just got into the room. Um, oh, you can't see. Yep. A bit wet. Wet, wet boobies. Yeah, Let's have a competition. We came out Brown Derby, mm. um, we then went on Star Tours and finally had a couple of different scenes, which mm -hmm. was nice. Yep. Um, then we went into the shop and I got the Star Wars... Been Here series been, is yeah, what they Yeah, Been called. Here series. And that was the one with the Mandalorian and Baby Yoda on it. Yeah. Um, and then... Then it just started to... Well, we, he, we walked through the shops... And then we said, oh, we're going to bother with ponchos because sometimes, like, unless it's real raining, ponchos can be more hindrance than, than what? Help. Yes. <laughs> um, and then I was like, I, I don't want, like, because you get sweaty under your poncho, you get a bit clammy and yeah. it's just not nice. Because it's still warm. So I said, oh, let me just switch over my glasses because I had these ones on and I don't like getting rain on them. And I was just going to put my sunglasses in my bag. And I literally had to turf out my whole entire bag because I thought I'd lost my sunglasses. That's what happens, kids, when you don't put your glasses back in their case. Oops. But they were just in a different pocket. Um, hmm. So that was a bit uh, squeaky bum time. So, yeah, we had some a bit, a bit of a dash to the bus. Yep. And then, <laughs> on the bus, we learnt a new game. <laughs> this game is called Poncho No Poncho. Yeah. And the idea of the game is that you are supposed to but stretch... Yes, well, bearing in mind, it's not one of the Disney ponchos. It's no. just one of like the throwaway L plastic, like a, like a plastic, plastic bag. Ones. But you stretch the poncho over your knee, and then the other person has to guess whether it's the poncho or, or not the poncho. Or your knee. Yeah. Um, and so these three sisters were playing poncho no poncho. By the end of it, their um, their ponchos were decimated. Well, so there was three of them, and the little one was like the feral one of the group, and she was just sitting there eating her pot literally trying to eat her poncho and her mum kept having to like pull the plastic out of her mouth and <laughs> telling her not to eat it yeah. and then because her sisters kept saying like poncho because she was putting it over her knee and they were guessing correctly and she yeah. was like oh i'm not talking to you ever again stop and then she pretend was like, you don't know <laughs> then she was just like ripping a poncho mm. off like the whole yeah um and these just three kids like usually 
kids are super annoying on the bus after a long day in the parks but these kids they just, made it I just, thoroughly entertaining i just kept laughing yep. at them they were hilarious so when you're out and about in the parks and you're bored after a long day poncho no poncho, poncho no that's poncho. how you do it tomorrow will be our first mm. full day at magic kingdom yeah um genie plus day again mm -hmm. um we're gonna get there for um rope drop and we're going to stay there till the fireworks are finished. So mm. it should be a very But we have got like a Grand day. Floridian like in the middle of the day. So Yeah, break it up a bit. And then just in case nobody saw earlier, I buy a Ah, oh, nice. look at him. There he is. So thank you very much for watching. Yep. Um, we're going to go and dry off. And uh, we'll see you next week. Good night. Bye.